Hi, friends. Today we're taking a look at Beacon's Bluff. It's a survive the night style game. We gotta survive for six hours. And we'll do some tasks in a creepy lighthouse. Hello there. You must be the new keeper. Let me introduce myself. My name is Barry Mundy. I work the day shift. You'll be working the midnight shift. From midnight until 6 a.m., you'll be the sole caretaker of the lighthouse. Take a look at the clock. As you can see, your shift starts soon. We have little time, so little time. You'll want to keep an eye on this meter. The measurement of the lighthouse's brightness naturally depletes over time. She's a fickle one, that lighthouse, but you can refill it by accomplishing tasks. The bright Brightness gets too low, you're in danger of letting the light extinguish. Whatever you do, don't let the brightness fully deplete. It is imperative the light stays on. Ships can crash on the rocks. Or worse. Well, anyway, take this handbook. The Keeper's Handbook. It will help you solve any issues you may run into during your shift. It's up to you now. Take good care of her. Your watch starts now. Let's do this. Uh, lighthouse is losing brightness. I don't want to go out. Look on any problem areas. As they spring up, they will take you to various tasks. Completing tasks regains brightness. Your shift ends at 6 a.m. Get to a keeper. The clock is ticking. Uh, press the buttons in the correct sequence. Oops. Task complete. Task complete. First 10 minutes. There's a little skill scroll up here. Oh. Next task. In the case of radio signal loss, drag the left dial to change channels. Indicator light will turn on when it's correct. Drag the right dial to adjust the tuning. Another indicator light will turn on when it's correct. The dial is going to be adjusted in either order. Turn on both lights to progress and repeat as needed. Oh, this is a little finicky on the mouse. Call it, turn on. Then we gotta do it, I guess, two more times. Oh. Ah. Okay. Nice. Okay, one more time. Okay, is that it? Come on, bro. Okay, yeah. Alright, not bad. Task complete. Uh, that that task wasn't wasn't that fun. Oh. Drag the pictures to straighten them all. Okay, short and sweet. This reminds me a little to the left, actually. You seem straight, but you're not looking into place. Come on. There it goes. Come on. There it goes. Task complete. Fix Lighthouse's turning mechanism. Find the stuck area, repeatedly smash it until it's unstuck. Repeat for each stuck area. Uh, okay. Uh, 
This is not a fun mini game. This is stupid. Okay. There you go. Task complete. Okay. Oh, I think I just hit one o'clock. We got six more hours. Of this. The uninhabitable, the uninhabitable island of Beacon's Bluff has a storied history. Near a major port, countless ships have crashed onto the rocks. Locals were rumored to banish criminals to the island, left to survive or perish. Survivors resorted to cannibalism, but that's just the tip of the iceberg. Survivors claim to see various supernatural phenomena, objects moving on their own accord, voices from the shadows. Some witnesses swore they would even seen a massive creature in the surf. Due to the regular burst of fog, ships are continuing to end up on the rocks. The decision was made to build a lighthouse on Beacon's Bluff. That's when the architect came into the picture. But not yet. Oh, I guess I see his face, kind of. All right, uh, we're only at like half sanity flashlight. Uh, and it's only one o'clock, so I, that's not great. Uh, okay, I guess it's a puzzle. I don't know puzzles work. Drag the puzzle pieces to make the puzzle go. Uh, huh? Uh huh? Uh huh? Uh huh? Corner piece. Ooh, nice. That goes there. This goes here. This goes there. That goes here. This is the top of the lighthouse. That's the corner piece. This goes right here. This goes right there. This goes right here. This goes right there. Here go vis a vis. Boom. All right, cool, cool. We got some light back. That's what we want. Oh, it's Cthulhu. Who do you, Cthulhu? Prevent an awakening. Rub the statue's belly to satiate the creature. Be aggressive. Be e aggressive. Okay, it's sort of working. Uh, be aggressive. Oh, what happened? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Got it. Okay, that worked. Task complete. The stove is going, but it's a picky eater and wants the firewood pieces in a certain order. Drag a firewood into the stove in its desired order to stoke the fire. Feeding it a piece at the wrong time and you'll have to start over. Ooh, I don't know if I'm going to be good at this. One, two, three, four, five, and six. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, Five, six. Ooh, hey, look, we're at full light. We went from like half light to full light. That's that's good. Oh, there's a little. Oh, those are restored sanity. Well, we're almost wasting those because those restored sanity, but we were at full sanity. Oops. On the path signs to find your way to the foghorn station. Make sure to follow the arrows. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, we've Put turn on the fog horn. Task complete. Oh, 
There's a little gremlin up here. Got him. Oh. Fill the tank. Press and hold the pump button. Avoid pumping during the red light. Careful, light timing is unpredictable. Oh, so it's red light, green light. Okay. Uh, I assume it'll go yellow, and you have to decide how much you want to risk. Okay, cool. Get it. Green light. Oh. Okay. Dang, that was a long, was a long yellow. Green light. Hands off. Uh, I guess we're, we're going. We're stopping too late. Green light. Oh my goodness, they're long yellows. I guess they're like the same length as the other one. I'm gonna risk it, try to finish. Got it. That's complete. Let's go. Close that door. Oh. Get it out of here. The correct time to stab the tentacle. Stab. 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 Gotta stab two more times. Stab. And stab. Yeah, I hear tentacle. Ask complete. Oh, there's a little guy over here. Up into the, oh, is it this one? Okay, so we got our first repeat puzzle. Which, I mean, we're almost halfway, so I suppose that's not surprising. Uh, this is the this is by far the worst. There's like not a visual indicator of what's wrong. Or even like where we should be clicking, like I hate it. Uh, uh, but you believe it's a merch mechanical key. You wonder what it unlocks. Probably trouble. All right, we got it working again. Pass complete. Okay, so we're coming up on three o'clock. This is the halfway point to six. Oh, fire went out again. Three, four. Oh no. Oh, look. Oh, it's hot. This isn't a normal lantern. After you touched it, you swear it gets brighter. Suddenly you're feeling awfully tired. Um, but no idea. Okay, one, two, three, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. And then four, five, six. Okay. Try this again. One, two, three, four, five, six. Well, I wonder if there might be a secret on every puzzle. Oh, it's time for another story. I kind of like the interlude music. The architect was a mysterious character. His plans for the lighthouse were extraordinarily advanced for the time. Maybe too advanced. 
rumors began to circulate that he was conducting occult rituals at night. Full moons, it was believed the architect and his cultists were requesting favors from ancient gods. If the old ones answered, what price did they demand? His wife disappeared during the construction of the lighthouse. Some folks believe the architect had her sacrificed and buried under the lighthouse. His foundation. Construction of the lighthouse was plagued with issues and delays. Workers complained of odd disturbances and sightings. A number of workers died during the construction and replacement hires stalled due to the rumors. On the day construction was finally finished, the architect fell from the tower to his death. Now, frankly, it's just not that impressive of a lighthouse, right? Like, not even that tall. Like, I've been taller lighthouses than that. Was it an accident? Was it because of grief over his wife's vanishing? Or was something more sinister to play? Regardless, the lighthouse was finally ready, but there was one big problem. It needed keepers. Turns out lots and lots of keepers. I'm wondering if we need to find secrets in all these places. Like, ah, uh, yeah. Hmm, is this some sort of compass? Better take it with you. So hang on. Uh, ooh, what's down here? Aha. What's this? A carrot. That's a carrot. Maybe you should hold on to it. Oh, that would carrot to me. Boom. Pass complete. This one again. Okay, where do we think the puzzle is? Oh, God. Or the secret, I mean. Oops, what's this? You really have no idea what it is. Only that you're desired greatly to keep it. Oops. <laughs> All right, we just. Well, good thing we were like, we were ahead because I've been messing things up. Oh, so there's a huge penalty for pressing it wrong. Okay, now. It's a huge amount of daylight. Hopefully we don't lose because of my quest for all these hidden items. Don't hit it again. Hit it wrong, I mean. Pretty big penalty. Basically lost almost half a time on this already. Half of the whole, uh, Oh, pushed it too far. All right, it's four o'clock. We need to just not lose. Ooh, uh oh, get worried. Okay, task complete. Something strange about it. Feels like it's emitting darkness rather than light. You can't stop staring into it. All right, we need to get ahead here. Huh? Two? Three? Four? Five? Six? 
seven, and eight. Made it out to the foghorn. Task complete. I guess we're just gonna do everything twice, I suppose. A model ship who put that back here. Some unknown reason I decide to keep it. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, I'm not exactly overjoyed with our light levels right now. Coming up on five o'clock though. That, oh, a little gremlin over here. Okay. Wonder, really see, okay, let's, uh, okay, this goes up here. That goes there, that goes there. Goes here, bottom, this is the other corner, so just like that. This, uh, this piece goes right here. This piece goes right there, which means we can kind of, now we can actually dip everything in. This is the upper corner over here. This is the corner down there. This goes into here. This goes right there. This goes right here. This goes right here. Okay, this is the last piece. See anything obvious? Oh, there it is. How this fit in there? Some sort of spyglass. It's worrying. It's warm to the touch. You can't resist looking through it and just see something that can't be unseen. All right. Uh, I do think all my searching for extra one hour. Low light. A little worried about that. Oh, time for another story time. Story time. I do like this interlude music, man. This interlude music hits. The lighthouse needs a constant supply of keepers because the lighthouse is hungry. Feed the lighthouse. Find more keepers. Let them be one with the light. The lighthouse loves you. Don't worry. It's for the greater good. The lighthouse cannot go out. Feed it. A little gremlin up there. Oh, okay. This is this one sucks. So hopefully we don't die on this. Okay. Add it. Oh my god. Light. Okay. One. That's two. Oh god, it's close. Oh, I had it. Shit. Great. Okay, still alive. Oh, I forgot to look for the the secret. Oh well. Okay, these guys are back. One, two, three, or, well, whatever. I don't think I care about finding every single secret. Four, got him. All right, task complete. We got some light back. All right, We've got 20 minutes of game time left. I think we're probably going to make it. Green light. That was a long yellow. 
That was a long yellow. Green light. Should have pushed it, but I mean, we've seen the penalty. The penalty is pretty steep. Green light. Cancel. I haven't had a single one where I was like close. One time I got punished, but like it's always like you take your finger off the gas and then it's like 40 minutes later. Ooh, light is about to go out though. It's also, game's about to be over. Oh man, it's close though. Oh, look at that. We're down to the, the embers. Oh, no, freaking. Dude, we lost with literally. Oh, my God. Eight out of ten secrets complete. Task completed 20. Oh, man. So that's. That is, what's this, what's this game's called? This game's fine. I forgot what it's called already. Something Bluff? Beacon's Bluff. Um, we go again? I mean, we'll go again. We're watching on YouTube, uh, hopefully we just, well, I guess we keep on looking for the, ah, that's the thing. Now I know that there's, let's go again. That's actually also those are three long yellows. So, but what can you do? Stop. So yeah, we definitely wasted a whole like sequence if we've been more aggressive. Six o'clock though. Hey, we did it. We made it till six. We survived our shift. Oh, you're still alive. I mean, you finished your shift. Honestly, I'm a bit surprised. That hasn't happened in a while. Well, I guess she likes you after all. I don't know. I guess you didn't meet her. I don't know. She likes to make an appearance around now. Well, she does like to test the keepers in her own secret ways. Maybe next time. I'll take it from here. Get some rest, keeper. Uh, she ship survived. Point task completed. Didn't give me secrets. Presumably you have to find all the secrets to meet the monster. I think we found like three or four total. Um so that was we're not gonna go we definitely don't care enough to go find the secret ending. Uh that was Beacon's Bluff. That took me 50 minutes, which is probably an embarrassing score. Thanks, Dr. H. Uh we're gonna play we're gonna move on to um